Get it? Get your rhythm, knock it down. Good. It's crazy. I didn't realize that until after the game, but, you know, it's just cool because she's been with me all throughout my basketball career, and it's just like, I don't know, it's a good way to end it. Time has run out on Donald S. Weeks Gymnasium. Columbia City will have a new high school building and thus a new gym next year. It means this three-pointer by Olivia Shearer in last Tuesday's win over Northrop was the last three hit by a girl at Weeks. Get into the pass, knock it down. The first three at the historic gym, well, that came from her mom and coach, Amy, over three decades before. Actually, it was in the pretty much the same spot, but on the right side. Mine was on the left high wing, hers was on the right high wing. I just brought up that I remember when I was a sophomore when the three-point line first was instituted in girls' high school basketball, that I remember on the left wing in the very first quarter hitting a three-pointer and just looking back at Wayne Krieger, who was coaching, he just kind of smiled at me and I smiled at him and nodded and we just went on and won the basketball game. Um, so I, I do remember that because we kind of laughed about it, the three-point line coming in and what advantage that would be for Columbia City basketball. I just... She was right next to me, and um, Andy Thompson, he does a radio, he's the one that told me, and I just smiled, and I just gave her a hug, and it was just, it was really cool. Yeah, it's a special relationship. We've traveled quite a bit playing basketball, but it's really been a, a whole family involvement. I mean, my son and my husband have both spent time rebounding for Olivia in our backyard. You know, my dad shot with me for hours and hours when I was a kid, and my dad shot with Olivia when she was a kid. You know, it's just kind of been everybody involved in that. Um, it's been interesting. I feel like when you have a kid and their parent is a coach, there's always potential for it to be a negative thing, but I feel like we've used it to our advantage, I guess, and the best it's been. And I think it's brought us closer in our relationship, and she's, she's coach, but she's also mom, and I know when she gets on me, like, just because she wants the best for me. There's a lot of memories and a lot of history. And you know, the gym who it's named after, Donald S. Weeks, he actually lived in the same neighborhood I did when I was in high school. And when the gym got named after him, that was just another special connection uh, that I have with that gymnasium. A lot of good memories. I'm Glenn Marini for State Champs.